hello guys with the another new tutorial how to install apricity os here i am using virtual box for this purpose so i'm just apri city here we oh sorry linux here we got arch linux 64 bit l64 bit l64 gb ram so providing 7 gb create a new next next where to store my so i have just home other location my personal directory here my vdi so here i'm just a pre city create save and just create and the settings go to storage here the disk part click choose virtual disk and os part and we go to apri city here and uh, click uh, okay what the hell what this is not some fun just start here and we got oh some outside noise so now I'm, I'm moving to full screen here I am giving some tips if you don't want to see this edge then just close the virtual box settings user interface and I and show in full screen this option cut off and just again start just go to full screen and damn you got you are go then just boot into apricity os let it boot now as you can see here our apricity os is running since i don't have installed uh, second display drivers for virtual box it's my secondary display so we are just it's a very nice interface i installed cinnamon display i don't like gnome i hate gnome because it's own we are we have own choices we have installed pre installed chrome we install and this uh, pacman pac mac is from Manjaro Linux so I have I using Apricity, Apricity OS is very good OS as I love Apricity but I am planning to install this new OS but as you can see some stuff I don't know about Apricity OS if you want to install a graphics so you have to install it from your own the state permission denied oh wow and as you can see here we don't he, they don't provide any installer directly here we have to go to and install apricity you have to search apricity it's a very nice user interface so it's a manjaro linux installer next kishan oops it's new name robokishan android since i am android lover here it is my password just next next and as you can see it's installing so it's still installing so now so now we are restarting it now boot existing OS we have some problem just close this and again settings storage and remove this uh, attachment 
again start this as you can see here it's a very nice grub boot menu that's on this as you can see here there is no plymouth boot image it's putting now oh my god virtual box having some serious problems i have upgraded to testing version of manjaro linux that's why this happening but it's trust me it's very nice let's open terminal our favorite environment ever should I ask you my password I will never type my passwords um, pacman so why why they have a pretty core also they have a mancha a uh, sorry arch linux cores nice now we go to we are looking for something there is no mouse pair let's see pacman dot uh we go to cd then ls cd pacman dot t less nano error list as you can see here it's arch linux user repository here we can see arch linux repository as you can see here it's a arch linux repository so uh, it's cool thing how to install now nvidia tools so it's simple you have to just nvidia nvidia dash utils and another some packages that are provided from arch linux here you can see it's automatically installed nvidia's all the stuff so we don't have to worry about this lsp dash lsp underscore release dash a as you can see here it's arch linux arch roaring release code name nothing so as you can see it's uh, nothing but the arch linux offline installer with the uh, new with the uh, cute gui so if someone wants arch linux with the gui installer with the offline installer you can use apricity os it's nice it's a very nice you it has a gui pacman pacmag a packet manager from manjaro linux so thank you for watching it's a conclusion that arch linux has uh, no gui installer and internet installer so if someone wants gui installer and offline installer then it can go with uh, apricity os so don't worry about this little window it's just a virtual box i can show you now i am using manjaro linux it's also arch based os but it has its own repository which has lot more pack pa pa packages than the arch linux so thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one